reporter peep would like you to like this video and subscribe or he will make a tv commentary on you the new jar of nutella my girlfriend tried to heat in microwave bought one of those ear cleaners with a camera and just pulled out a contact lens i have no idea how long it was in there there was a blizzard last night so we decided to check on our car kept hearing a weird grinding noise in the corner of my dark room. I turn on my flashlight and see my cat chewing on the headstock of my custom vintage Fender Strat. I'm furious. I know you're not feeling well, let me move your car for you. The next morning. Found out why my house started to smell every time the water heater kicked on. Came from an 8 hour flight just to find that the people of the airport broke into my luggage. My inspected batteries from Amazon. Got a new mixer and plugged it in while pushing the mixers in place. Accidentally tuned it on and decided to mix my middle dinger. I can't even bend the mixer back to form and my dinger still hurts. Cars frozen from sea water arriving to Vladivostok port. My little cousin shoved my game cartridge up a toy school bus and I can't get it out. Had to have double foot surgery. My dog locked me out of the house. It is raining. Coming home from just half an hour going to my parents. Wanted to put son in bed. Notice his window was broken into. New lights in my Mustang. Then literally 10 minutes later. Spent $150 on my first glass blowing class. Promptly dropped the bowl I made after bringing it home. Someone's car is behind 7 feet tall drifts and there is no other way out besides plowing through them. Left my cheese sticks in the oven a little too long. A leak under the hot tub during winter. Someone stole the ATM from a local pharmacy. Got stung by a wasp in the middle of a snowstorm. I broke the first bowl I ever bought 16 years ago. Feels bad man. Should have called for the pros. Got a tattoo today. I'm super allergic to adhesives. I'm in so much pain. Started a new teaching job and was into the lesson today and sat on a desk to explain the book we were reading. Thankfully nobody was sitting there. My coat came with spare parts today. My husband's OnePlus started snow skiing and then melted slash disintegrated. Postman ruined my day and I ruined one of my cups trying to get it out. Rushing to take dinner out of the oven. Was so excited. Lost my grip. RIP eggplant palm. My frozen burrito seemed a bit thin. So I thawed and unwrapped it. Friend's charger at school broke apart, and a piece is now stuck in outlet. First snowboarding session of the season. Found this lone little bugger on the train. Someone's gonna have a bad surprise. Try door dash for the first time. Someone stole half my whopper. Dropped a whole bottle of hot sauce. Being a dog person that is allergic to dog saliva. Bought a pepperoni pizza from Sam's Club. I did indeed get a pepperoni. Got a little windy today. Accidentally dropped and thus spilled my cough syrup into this change holder in my car. I found a robot hair in our fries today. Stuck in France at 2 in the morning as the hotels closed, after telling them we'd be arriving at 2. 
Last night on the highway my hood latch randomly failed. Completely smashed my windshield. My bike wheel got stolen while I was at work. Had to walk 3 miles to get home. Drove 7 hours down to California just to meet this sign. Sigh. Keep out. Sewage contaminated water. Exposure may cause illness. I thought there would be some fancy way of opening it for a straw. Duck. My earplug fell apart inside my ear when I tried to take it out and I had to go to the emergency room. I hoped my truck repairs would cost $300 marks. Sale amount. $2,153.71. Didn't notice until I was halfway done. To the contact lens, I raise you a baby brown recluse spider that my doctor pulled out last week. Moving can be stressful. Guess I'm not getting in my car. When you somehow forget one of the biggest food items in your shopping cart. Tried ripping out an old nail slash coat hanger. My hammer said, no, always spend the extra few bucks on tools. Bought this watch two months ago. Fell over because of a branch. Was in mechanic shop for a year. Went 40 miles per hour down the road now. Ordered a new iPhone directly from Apple. Box arrived completely empty. Departing for sea today, uck. Left my hotel room window open for the stench got drove by a teen with fries, never again. Midday theft, I was at the rec center with my 4 year old. Snacks. Just drop my limited edition coca-cola glass that I got from McDonald's 12 years ago in Taiwan. My potato is like a jeered. It's too early for this shot. Glad I'm not the car behind. Came home the day after a blizzard. Wind somehow blew open the locked door and rifted snow into the garage and opened the door leading into the house, letting all my heat out. One of my neighbors is in for a surprise. Wind knocked a tree down whilst I was driving 50 miles per hour in the middle of nowhere. Great first day of my holiday. Went to replace ceiling panel, this is what was leaking. Thought two puzzles in one meant it was double sided. Turns out it's two mixed together that I have to sort out as another puzzle. Been using a cheap set of cooking knives for 15 plus years and recently broke an old cutting board. Finally ordered what I thought was a decent knife set with a cutting board. Not only was it clearly used with food still on the knife, the cutting board came be broke. I dropped my keys into a storm drain. Midwest winter doesn't play around. My card fell from my desk and my dog found it. A truck wrecked my two month old car. The lines on my measuring cup wore off. The steak wasn't even tough. Thanks to the tractor that was chucking rocks and gravel all up the A5 during rush hour. Here's my Mini Cooper windscreen after overtaking your unsheeted load. McDonald sign toppled by high winds onto car. Street was flooded and I didn't know until I came around the corner and hit a super deep puddle at 40 km per hour. Just what you need on a Friday avo. Broke a glass door in my basement. This was a beautiful, shady, wooded area for decades and was why my parents moved here in the first place. Now it's all gone. 
10 minutes in a 5 hour drive and I spilled a full Dunkin coffee, soaked the dash, floor, my pants, and hawkers. Here is how it landed, the steam is still rising from the spilled coffee. Had a 11 hour work day, came home to make enchiladas, finally ready to eat them and bam. Seems like I have been driving with this screw in my tire for a while. Half our TV just burned out. Passed by this on a street in Hollywood. Forgot to wear gloves while cleaning my keyboard with alcohol and hydrogen peroxide. Turns your skin super white and dry and itchy and achy in my case. Uck. I want to cry. My food. All I wanted to do was take out the trash and I tripped. Sprained not broken. My friend ordered a sink from Wayfair. Instead he got a 70 pound puzzle that you can't put back together. He got a full refund. My cat knocked one of my plants down this morning. Went to get the broom out of my car and the door handle snapped off into my hand. Because of the freezing weather, now I'm stuck with a mess and a car door that doesn't work properly. Doe, a deer, a female deer. Just got this car 4 months ago, 2022 Honda Civic X, and my rear windshield randomly shatters while I'm driving. My ears are still ringing. How even? Chia seed back fell over in the middle of the night a few weeks ago. Still finding them on the floor every day. Guy attempting to withdraw some cash. Tripped over my mouse charging cable. Bye bye 6, 30 year old trees. They are diseased and dying. Oh dear. Someone is gonna have a bad morning. My house burnt down. While we were away at our grandma's. Beer with wife went well. Crock pot lid shattered for no reason. While I was cooking lentils. Came home from beach. To find a raccoon very much wanted to be my roommate. My bathroom has flooded three times today. It started because my little brother kept trying to flush his shut. Even though the water was going up. We are all out of towels. Stumbled upon this on my walk this morning. Someone is not happy lol. I was having such a good day too. I had to bother emergency maintenance personnel to get into my house. When you buy a cheap candle and it's scented wax poured over three plain candles. This empty hot pocket. Dad ripped out the cable slash internet wire while trying to clear the driveway in a snowstorm. My 8 inches delta grinder took a fall off a station and completely cricked the coarse stone and possibly bent the shaft as it was on at the time. Flight from Oklahoma to Atlanta got delayed from 4pm until 7pm, then diverted to Birmingham in the last 100 miles. Wife has just arrived at the airport and is now turning around. New ETA is 1.30 am. Got a flat tire on the highway driving home from a show. At midnight. At least the show was good. Went to the ladies room at work and damn near grabbed a toilet seat cover. Who raised this animal? This is the box that lets me into my apartment building. My building manager doesn't work on Sunday. Someone left their car in the staff car park and went on holiday but wasn't told about the changes happening while they were gone. Going to come back to their car, stuck right in the middle of a work site. Accidentally busted my car mirror while backing out of the garage. Mom spent 4.5 months on this, only to be missing 15 pieces. Blister I hiked with for 4 miles today. Not one but two plan to plate tears from walking 2 to 5 miles per day. Very painful. 
Looks like I'm having bag soup for lunch today. So the cake box isn't rainproof, after all. Came home to this last night. Stay classy Columbus. Who steals a fire extinguisher? He's stuck like that since yesterday. And the key doesn't work anymore. Saturday night I managed to chop a bit of my left indexinger off. Whilst loading a trailer I jammed it between a metal frame and some wood. I've cut my bone in my dinger lengthways. I was not able to take a photo of the x-ray, but I've drawn a illustration. Got to the bottom of my milkshake, and there's a lid. Definitely got blended. After fighting a sinus infection I was putting air in my tire, only to have it explode in my face. Let my white cat out, and she rolled in a flower bed. She's caked in dust now. It doesn't hurt her, but it gets dust everywhere. I have no clue how to clean her. Had this watch for 3 years, it broke one week before returning to college. Meaning I can't get it repaired before heading out. Second snow day with the kids started like this. Broil on high as an A. Forgot to put the top back on. How's everyone else's day going? Someone had a bad morning. My wife came home from walking the dog and had an 8mm socket stuck in her right rear tire. Yesterday some kid backed into my car and today my brother was in a multi-car accident due to a jaywalker on a busy street. Fell on the ice a few days ago. Turns out I left my sushi on the roof of my car. Someone drove into a gen fed and stole the whole ATM. Always check the site you are ordering from. Be careful when you sit on the back of the bus. Discovered black mold behind, under and on our bed, which is just a mattress on the floor, because our bed broke. We are now sleeping on nothing but bedding in the spare room. This lady's car had to circle back and capture the photo after first seeing it. Napkin caught fire in a renovated apartment. Brand new carpet burnt. I was taking a picture of the hairline crick in this bowl. My neighbor left their windows cricked while it rained all night. My dinger from January 1st to February 1st after a crushing. Make sure that oil pan in the back seat is level. Accidentally broke my glasses. This happened to the bus I was riding. I have been struck like many others with the unwise wisdom tooth. Base of my armchair broke off. Majorly this afternoon, wife dropped a Pyrex glass somehow and it shatters her salad and my chili. There were three other containers full. I had just poured them about three minutes earlier. Just got my DoorDash. Guess where the receipt was stapled. My earbud fell out again. At almost 5am on the way to work. I found it later. Magnets not working. Literally bought this lamp last night, thankfully only $30, and this happened in the morning. My cat is partly to blame, no big surprise. Friends windows were destroyed during an automatic car wash, while trapped with no way out. Who else thinks an emergency shut off button needs to be inside these things? Currently in Nepal with very little access to healthcare. Can't say I'm overjoyed to have this new addition to my body. As I was walking home from work today, the metal strap clip for my bag completely sheared from years of wear against the metal hoop. Dropped a heavy mixing bowl onto the bottom of another mixing bowl when loading the dishwasher. 
got a fly trap to get rid of flies, and they are still digesting while there's flies on the loose. My backyard fed all of its snow into my driveway. Poured myself a bourbon and coke with a really nice bourbon, only to find out the coke was completely flat. TV I bought in 2017 stopped turning on, at least I can still watch HBO on my little tablet. Got a TV like 2 years ago broke it a month ago now it's calling me an ace clown. Ace clown. Took an airbag to the forearm. You can see where the emblem hit my skin. Gas price in euro per liter in Slovakia, where minimum wage is 646 euros before taxes. I love this country. I was working on a drawing for my college portfolio, and then my iPad's hardware became damaged. There's no way to get the drawing back, or fix my iPad either, so I will have to replace it out of pocket. Had a spring coming out an inch or two out of my bed. Had to bend it back, to avoid leaving another two or three inch scratch on my arm. The door fell off the cabinet and hit me. Wanted to get into the Valentine's Day spirit. The wind opened the door to my gate is so hard that it shattered. Somehow my boss is still gonna let me keep my job.